Hey guys, um, so I redid a song that I've actually posted on here, um, and as the lights come up, um, <laughs> in the apartment, I have like five minutes before I should be in bed, uh, probably less than that, uh, <laughs> so I just wanted to sing, um, the revamped version of, uh, the song I call Restless, um, or Wind, um, I haven't chosen necessarily, um, but I hope you like it. Stand in the 
sinking boat Trying to keep hope afloat Lord, I need you more Than I did before Run with me Hold me close Remind me You're the wind, not the enemy the great I am. You run with me. Tell me you love me. Remind me who I see your face oh Lord and I can feel your love and even when I'm scared or completely unprepared I know I can fall into your arms So that's the song. Hope you guys liked it. Um, it's mostly, sorry, there's a motorcycle revving outside of my place, which is great. Or a scooter, probably a scooter, in my neighborhood. Um, <laughs> but anyway, um, it's about the fact that, um, at least I hope it's about this, um, the fact that you always think of wind as the bad guy in a storm. Like, wind is the one that pushes the waves on top of you and makes it so that you can't hear anything and makes chaos happen. Um, but for me, it's not the wind that makes chaos happen. It's the wind that keeps the waves from hitting me and the wind that pushes my boat off course so that I don't get hit by the huge wave. I only get the small ones or uh, the wind that makes me realize that I need to ask for help. Um, and to say something and to speak up because just listening may not work at that time. Um, so that's, you know, that's kind of what it's about. And it's about God being that wind um, for me. Um, God always being there and being able to, basically, he's just able to keep the worst things in life from happening and... I know some people might say, well, I have cancer, or I have, I have a friend with a brain tumor right now. Um, and it's a friend from college that I don't really talk to, and I feel like a jerk for not talking to them, and now they have this brain tumor, and I'm really worried for her, and she has surgery tomorrow, and... It's not about me, but it is It is making me realize that I need to be more attentive to people that I care about. And um, I'm sure in this moment, my, f my friend from college doesn't know what to do. Um, I would have no clue what to do. I have 13 illnesses, and I get overwhelmed by those, and they're not even a brain tumor or whatever. So... Um, 
you know, there's things like that where we think, well, if God's supposed to keep us from harm, how can that happen? And the thing is, in the middle of the storm, you think that he's up there in the sky and he's making all this wind and chaos happen when really he's, he's allowing the wind to push you away from the chaos to have you come out on the other side of the storm. And he... I've never thought that God made it so that I had to go through a test to learn something. But I have learned in all of the crud and the things that I've gone through in my life. Um, recently, previously, when I was a kid and my parents divorced, you know, all that stuff which more and more people have experienced. I just think, but at least he's with me and the thing is I need to remember like my song says, that he's right beside me. He's in that little boat that's sinking with me, and he's trying to get me to look straight at him and realize that he's right there. When I'm screaming at the sky, he's right next to me. And he's there for me, no matter what. And I just have to remember that. And sometimes I really stink at remembering that. Um, and just trying to do better about remembering that he's there for me. Um, and just remembering that there's hope there, and there's strength there. And I know not everybody believes in God, um, but I would say, even if you don't, he's still right beside you. Even if you don't care or don't want him or whatever, he's still there. And there's been times when I've been so angry and so mad and so flippant towards God. And just going, oh, I don't need you. I can do this on my own. And the thing is, I can't do any of it on my own. I was almost homeless. I was almost without food. And even though I'm fat, you wouldn't know that, but... <laughs> I just, you know, I have medical bills up to wazoo and I'm trying to pull out of debt and honestly, no one can help me but God. He can help me realize how wonderful I am and how beautiful I am and how much I'm worth and to make sure that I give myself all the opportunities that he has for me. And I think one of those is to help other people. So, I didn't mean to get this all super wishy-washy emotional whatever but and wishy-washy is not the right word <laughs> but super sappy is what I was thinking um, and but just know if you're going through something that sucks you're allowed to waller and vent and say it sucks for a little bit <laughs> I do that often <laughs> but then make sure you realize what opportunities you have when I was homeless I had the, well, I wasn't homeless when I, sorry, let me rephrase that. When I was almost homeless, or when I thought that I was going to end up being homeless for a period of time, or not be able to find a permanent place to live, um, I had the opportunity to learn how awesome my friends and family and coworkers and everybody was, and when I couldn't afford food, I learned the same thing, and I had a grocery fairy who would bring me groceries and people who would just leave stuff at my church so that I could have food. And yeah, I probably could stand to lose some weight, so not having food probably wasn't a hardship for me, but I want to help. I want to return those favors someday. And so the opportunity to get to know those friends and that family was just amazing. And they're amazing people, and I wasn't giving them the opportunity to be amazing because I thought I could do everything on my own. So in a roundabout way, that's what my song is like. I just need to realize he's the wind. God is the wind, and he is trying to get my attention in the still small breezes, in the huge chaotic storms. He's trying to let me know that he's right beside me. And I'm sorry I've forgotten that. I'm working on it.
have a good night guys